Hi, and welcome to another episode of Mr. Puzzle, back after the summer break and today with a brand new puzzle, at least for me, the Wiper Cross by Winco, made in design in Czech Republic by Václav Obzivac, a classic or not, not too much a classic, but a disassembly, reassembly puzzle that looks quite complex, not sure why it's called Wiper Cross, maybe because things like Wiper, Predator, Lion, Scorpion, Eagle are just sound good and gain some attention, I have no idea. But let's get this out of the box and let's have the first look how this puzzle looks like and what it's about. I think this puzzle has six identical pieces as usual for Winco. It comes with a description or kind of a description how to solve it here. Therefore, don't look inside if you are not really struggling with it. And this looks already quite impressive quality wise. By the way, it's made from plum wood. These dark areas are plum and the bright areas are maple. Quite impressive. And if I see these pieces, I would assume it's kind of a coordinated motion puzzle. By the way, this puzzle has also a compartment inside. There is a wooden ball trapped inside and the task is to free this wooden ball and get it back together means you can also use this puzzle as kind of a puzzle box or stash box maybe for a present i don't know or something else but this is a pretty cool packaging for something you would like to give away looks amazing is made very very well and of course i also like to figure out how well it is from puzzling point of view the difficulty by the way on the winko scale is three out of maximum of five. Let's see if it will get the same rating on my personal difficulty rating scale, or maybe a little bit easier or more difficult. So it definitely sounds interesting. It looks amazing. It feels amazing in your hand. And I'm really looking forward to see how cool it is from puzzling point of view. So let's see how to disassemble this thing. And oh, I think it's quite easy to disassemble, as you can see. <laughs> Yeah, if I twist it, the parts come apart. Wow, this looks cool. The ball is already out. And now I just take it apart. Woo, it falls apart. Maybe I should have looked how these pieces have been exactly been joined together. I forgot about it, but um, this looks pretty amazing here. I mean, look at these pieces, how well they are made very cool and if you know what type of puzzles Winko is usually doing this is exactly the type of puzzles a lot of puzzles of them are made quite complex coordinated motion puzzles that you somehow need to disassemble which is most of the times easy but getting that back together is something different as you can see and imagine if you see those pieces i'm just gonna check now if all of these pieces are identical which is an important detail but they look they look definitely the same so I will just put them here aside in a more package friendly way and start with these two pieces. What was the initial shape, by the way? Uh, I think it should be like so. Yes, okay. So it makes sense to put these chamfered areas here on those. This looks right. And I think this is already the right approach. Get one piece in here. Whoa! No, this is gonna be this is gonna be a fiddly and tricky one. I think. Let's see. Whoa. Ah, okay. Now they are together. The more parts are there, the more tricky it gets, probably. Mm. Whoa. Whoa. I see no way how to join two or three pieces and then put it together. You need to slide them apart and back together again. Here we go. Back in again. Now, let's see. <laughs> mm. Come on. Come on. Yes, okay, now four together. Oh, look at this wood here with this purple look or grain. Very cool. 
So next one, this time I try to get it in over here. No, this is wrong. How can I get it back or sliding back together? So if I put them like so, I'm going to push. Where do I need to push to get them together? It's not actually, it's not really tricky to solve or to understand what you need to do, but it's really tricky to get it done. Mm. No, no, no. I will try again. Let me try again. So this one over here. Maybe, maybe let me try like this. Let me, let me get four pieces in place already and then just lift the bottom and the top at the same time. Maybe this works out. Let me, let me see. This would be a cool trick. Another one in here. So these are now joined. These four are now joined. The one on the bottom probably also. Yes, it is. Oh, I think I got it. Now I get this one in. Like so. And now carefully. Carefully. Ooh, 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 ooh. Lift the one on the bottom maybe. Where is it? This one? Oh, come on. This was elegant, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, and this is also how you can open and close it. If I pull this one down. Wow, look at this. Look how this comes together again. Oh, this is insane. You see this? All these sliders, sliding pieces. So if I take this out again to the top, I can put whatever I want inside. The size of the compartment seems to be as big as two pieces. So like a cubicle compartment in this height of like maybe three centimeters. Wow, I put in the ball again. Bam, here it goes. And I can tell you already puzzle solved. Pretty cool puzzle, pretty satisfying to handle. If you are a collector of wooden puzzles, this is definitely a must have. And also, beside the puzzling, it's a very, very cool display piece. The difficulty, though, is not too difficult. I would rate this with a 2 out of a maximum of 5. So one less than the initial rating from Vinco puzzles. The reason why I'm rating this lower is that you figure it out quite quickly how to disassemble it. Actually, basically, you just need to spin it and it's already solved. But the assembly is a little bit more tricky, but after one or two minutes you already realize how to do it and then it's just a thing of dexterity and the right idea how to join it and this was also not too difficult to find however i consider this still a very very cool and clever puzzle an excellent design and excellent craftsmanship so definitely recommendable from my side so that's it for today about the wiper cross puzzle, a pretty cool puzzle. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. From now, more puzzle videos again here on my channel. Hope you will join me and until next time, keep on puzzling.